We're nearing the end of the pile of uh, that pile, that uh, bunch of locks I bought off of eBay. This is a U.S. lock manufacturer lock, or the company is named U.S. Lock. Uh, let's see what we got here. It is a Schlage keyway. Uh, it looks to be a five pinner, and it even has their logo. Even though it's a Schlage key, they made their own style key. There we go. And let's see if we can get this thing picked. I have not picked it, so this will be breaking new ground. I'll tell you what, maybe we can... Let's try to pick it backwards, just for the hell of it. Turn it just a hair more, so I can get a good angle here. Alright, if it is a Schlage, or Schlage-like, there should be no security pins. They depend on wild bidding and... Uh, Precision manufacturer, and if US lock is the same, I think that's pretty much what we can suspect on this one as well. But we'll know if we get a if we get a false set, we'll know something. We'll know the formula has changed. Typical Schlage's nice and tight. Strings are real, or springs are very strong. I think there's a, probably a pretty new lock as well, but based on the condition. Compared to some of those old ones we've been picking, this one is in stellar shape. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's no security pins. We got no surprises there. No, it's just a question of, with all that spring tension, did we get over aggressive and overset something? That first one is still springy. Mm, here we go. Open. Here we go, fellas. It's a U.S. lock, but I think the way it acts, the way it picks, it's nothing but a dressed-up schlage. Looks like maybe Schlage's copyright or patent ran out and U.S. lock copied them, but there's what we're looking at. Uh, I don't think there's any need to gut it. Nothing special inside of there. No security pins or anything. Anyway, thanks for your time. Everybody stay safe. Stay legal.